All right, guys, so this is a big day for me. Uh, I have been commissioned to do the other route and the big fan route on a big, huge upcoming house build project. Um, this house is a couple years away, but we're going to uh, today be picking up these two routes for sure um, and looking at some other pieces that we're potentially going to use that I think will be really cool. Um, so yeah, stay tuned. I'm going to flip it around and, and we're going to inspect what we're getting. Let's go. Okay, so we got the route outside. Uh, I'm not like a very tall dude, I'm definitely average height, but this thing is almost as tall as me, so there's gonna be a lot of milling we're gonna have to do when I come back in a few weeks. Um, but just take a look at this thing, man. Incredible. Um, super, super excited. Uh, this is the cut side right here. I don't know if it'll let you see. This is where the current route that I have um, was cut off of on this cut side here. So that's the really cool part about this project is it's for the same client. So he's gonna have both of these routes. Um, this piece here is gonna have a nine foot wide by probably an 18 to 20 foot long piece of acrylic for the top. Uh, we're gonna mill the top, probably make the bottom a little bit more flat. Uh, it's already been sandblasted, so that's really cool. It has the same color as the one that I have. Man, this thing is incredible. I cannot wait to show the progress in this one. So this is uh, like chin height for me. That's how tall this thing is. It's really hard to get the scale of it. But yeah, it just has a sense it's 15 wide. 15 long, about eight and a half ish wide. There's going to be quite a bit that we'll have to take off. But good golly, it's coming on. I'm looking for a hide and go seek right there. Okay, it's just under 18 feet long. 18. I mean, the good news is it's only seven foot deep. Cut it in half. It was just incredible. I mean, it just was. I mean, I'll show you the pictures of our. John with a seven foot bar whittling. Really? <laughs> Matt, where are you going to work on his place? I think I, I, there's two bays. No, yes, I don't, I don't know if he would do it out in the in that dance floor. What are you gonna do? Put this on a cart? Yeah. Or machine? Right. You know, machinery we, dollies or something? I have to ask him. Yeah. He might, you know, know. He... Okay. So this is the big fan route required. It's uh, 17 feet wide, 11 feet tall, and about seven feet thick. And this is gonna be going into an executive office in that brand new house against the wall and we're going to make a super trick throne chair and it's going to be kind of like a Game of Thrones-esque throne. It's going to be the most epic thing ever.
Sandblasted though. I mean, technically, it's the bottom. I want to see what the top looks like. Yeah. Still a lot of rock though, huh? That's yeah, that. Goes all the way through. Yeah. Hey, you think we could uh, throw that top piece on here to see what it looks like? Yeah. You pull that? Yeah. It's faulting, dude. Oh, yeah. That's sick. Wow. Yeah, it's faulting is sick. You need some massive CA glue. Dude, is this already bleached? Um, we did a long time ago. Did you? Have you had it for a while? Yeah, I mean, this is all—it's all part of the same collection. Oh, it is. Uh, okay. These are all a stack of brown ebony. Oh, interesting. This is a fast stone cookie tree, bottom of the tree, cut. It's 12 inches thick, it's dry. And you have to mill it again because it kind of kicked up a little bit on this side. What we should do. Another one that's dry, not as big. But it's a kind of walnut cookie. You'd have to mill some off too, because there's some funky spots. Another really cool brown ebony cookie. Cool green. Hard to see, but. Gosh, what a blast that was, guys. Thank you so much for watching. So on the recap, I purchased the big, massive underground route and also the big fan route. I already know what you guys are thinking. Why is he buying more routes without even showing us the second part of the first route video? I promise you, it's coming. It's actually completed, and I'm just waiting for the client's house to be finished up. I wanted to give you a sneak peek of the intro to that video and a little bit of footage of me sanding and polishing 
some of the cut side. So stay tuned on that. I promise it's coming and it'll be totally worth it. But thank you again for watching this video. I had a ton of fun at GL with Dan and Jeff. Picked up some really cool pieces and I'm very excited for those projects in that massive house that I'll be potentially furnishing uh, the majority of. Uh, shoot me your comments below and um, we'll see you next time. Nice. It's almost go time. <laughs>